Hello, I'm Dr. Brian Martin, uh, Chief of Pediatric Dentistry at Children's Hospital of Pittsburgh of UPMC. And I'm here to speak with you today about the how-tos and whys of oral health care. This brushing technique is very simple. What it involves is making a small circular motion near the gum line of each tooth, and then every so often making a little bit of a sweep away from the gum line. We work the toothbrush from the back of the mouth towards the front, brushing in small circles and sweeping downwards or upwards away from the gum line. We do this for two reasons. First, because the small circular motion is very gentle on the gums. And secondly, the, small, the sweeping motion helps clear the plaque or sticky film off of the teeth and into the mouth where it can be rinsed away. We work from one side around to the front, then following across the front teeth to the other side, working towards the back of the mouth. Here we do the same motion, small circular with a sweep, cleaning the plaque off of the teeth with the soft toothbrush. We use a soft toothbrush because we don't want to wear away the teeth. You can check how soft a toothbrush is by simply running your fingers across a toothbrush. It should feel very soft. If the, tooth, if the toothbrush feels very stiff, you may have a denture toothbrush, which we certainly don't want to brush, use to brush. After cleaning the outside surfaces of the teeth, we open the mouth, clean the chewing surfaces of the teeth with a back and forth sawing motion. And then we do the inside of the teeth, top and bottom, with the same small circular and sweeping motions, working our way all the way around the mouth. During this process, it's important that we have an adequate, but not too much toothpaste on the toothbrush. We recommend using a amount of toothpaste about the size of a pea. This will prevent unnecessary foaming and gagging while still providing an adequate amount of fluoride to strengthen and clean the teeth.